Right, if somebody's got pulmonary edema or pulmonary congestion, you're like, well, there's fluid in the lungs. Okay, but what if the chest texture was completely clear? There's no congestion. But can you make out if the patient is volume depleted? On your chest texture, you can see your right atrium. Your right atrium could either be plumped out and nice and juicy, meaning it's full because the patient is volume overloaded, or it can actually be flat, implying that the patient is volume depleted. Again, these are all very small, subtle surrogate markers you're looking for. Say you got a CT scan of a patient. CT chest, abdomen and pelvis. Can you tell the patient's volume still is based on a CT? What are you looking at? Yes, so I think volume overload will be pretty obvious. Question is, what about volume depletion? IBC. Yes, you can see the IVC diameter. If the IVC is all shriveled up and small, then you know the patient is volume depleted. You can also do an ultrasound and look at your IVC. If your IVC looks nice and full, the patient has good enough volume. But if not, then the patient needs volume. What else can you do at the bedside on your patient to see if the patient will be fluid responsive?